Uh, Tamil Nadu has also now been chosen by Foxconn as the state for a fresh investment of 1600 crore rupees. The investment will go into building a mobile handset component plant in Kanchipuram. And there have, however, also been reports pushed by a news agency that the MOU had not actually been signed. India Today Group's Akshita Nandagopal caught up with Tamil Nadu Industries Minister T.R.B. Raja to find the truth and also catch up on the state's semiconductor plants. The big headline is a Foxconn coming together with the Tamil Nadu government, setting up in Kanchipuram, I understand. Mm -hmm. That is happening, yes, because there's a lot of back and forth on it. It's a conglomerate. There are a lot of uh, uh, subsidiaries of uh, Honai. So I think there was a small confusion with, uh, with one of those reporters putting the mic to some other subsidiary and they're saying, what is this about? So they should have gone and asked the right Foxconn, the one which signed the MOU uh, with the... With the with the uh, Tamil Nadu government, there was an LOI which is given, and they are coming for sure. And this investment is definitely coming into Chennai, into Tamil Nadu. Um, you know, you have focused a lot on electronics manufacturing. I think the government in large has. So, with Foxconn coming in, how is it really a game changer for Tamil Nadu? It brings in a lot of jobs, of course, but overall, also for your vision of making Tamil Nadu the number one electronics manufacturing hub. Not just for Fox has already been there and uh, many other leaders are already there in Tamil Nadu. Tamil Nadu is a leader in electronics to exports today. We did 5.37 billion last year and this is only going to go. We, we're gonna, you're going to see numbers zoom in the next year also because new manufacturing capabilities are being built. A lot of new uh, companies are also coming in. Apple components are coming in, I'm told. So there are a lot of, uh, lot of action in the electronics segment in, uh, in Tamil Nadu. We're going to see, see some brilliant numbers come up. We, we don't mind other states also uh, taking investment. They, they should, you know, cut short of saying that, you know, it's going out of Tamil Nadu. No, nothing is going out of Tamil Nadu. There's more investment coming. And you'll see uh, more big, big names coming in the very near future. You made a mention, and I remember reading recently, that you're saying you envision Tamil Nadu becoming the manufacturing, electronics manufacturing hub across Asia. And that's a, you know, big ask. Do you see that happening in the next few years? It's not a big ask. It's not a big ask given the infrastructure that's already in place, um, the, the talent that, is, that, that we produce in Tamil Nadu. Um, we have some of the highest number, we have the highest number of engineers coming out of uh, colleges in Tamil Nadu. Um, we lead the nation in a lot of numbers, right? And having these innate capabilities already built in, I don't think it's going to be a very tough job. Uh, especially um, under the, the able leadership of our chief minister, we're going to see some amazing numbers very soon. So I, I'm very com confident that we can reach our goals, uh, and especially the goal of our chief minister, which is a trillion dollar economy. Um, electronics manufacturing, Dick. What about semiconductors? Is that next for Tamil Nadu? Are you going to Pip Gujarat? <laughs> Okay, Semicon, you know, you know how the PLI works and uh, Tamil Nadu is not a very desperate state. Mm -hmm. that, that is something we should keep repeating in most of my interviews. Uh, we want to make sure that whatever we incentivize um, results in proper jobs for our people. Jobs are key. It's not the number of investment or whatever that comes through. It's, it's the jobs, uh, it's the jobs that, are, that are needed by our people, um, the jobs that are suited for our people, that is what we are after. Yes, semiconductor is a big step, um, and fabs are not really easy to uh, get uh, into. It's a very, very niche uh, area. Uh, but we are particular, and I think the infrastructure is already in place, so I'm sure the investment will definitely come through. Uh, when, when the people, assess, when industry assesses the existing infrastructure, Tamil Nadu will definitely come up top.